Nature has placed mankind under the governance of two sovereign masters, pain and pleasure. It is for them alone to point out what we ought to do. Jeremy Bentham Let's get comfortable. Relax and take a couple deep, mind-calming breaths. Breathe in deep. And exhale. Breathe in deep. And exhale. People usually experience pain when the brain receives an electrical signal from nerve sensors, warning of tissue damage. If the signal does not reach the brain, such as in the case of an epidural, the pain is not experienced. If the signal does reach the brain, the meaning is then interpreted consciously or unconsciously. This means that our history with pain can make us more sensitive to it. This sensitivity can be affected by fear, frustration, anxiety, and repressed negative emotions. With this in mind, can we change our relationship with pain? What if we could become more intentional when we experience pain? Don't run. Don't even try to avoid it. But work toward accepting it. Feel it. Ask yourself why the sensation is so uncomfortable. Could you objectively measure this discomfort? What is it about this electrical signal and the brain's response to it that is so undesirable? What am I doing or not doing in service of this discomfort?
Pain can be a mix of physiological, neurological, emotional, and psychological systems in the body, evolved over a long period of time. This complex, imperfect structure may work great at times, and at other times may be overly sensitive. Be patient, thankful, encouraging, and supportive with yourself. <laughs>